Hi everyone, I'm David James, your hair diva, and welcome to the step-by-step -step tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to achieve Nicole Scherzinger's big curly hair that she wore at Disco Week for X Factor this weekend gone. So let's get to work. So step one in this tutorial, we need four things. A can of hairspray, sectioning clips, a pair of curling tongs, and a comb. So first off, what we need to do is take a section of hair just in the nape, section it off, using your clips to put it out of the way, because at the moment we don't need this section. Lightly spritz with hairspray, using your curling tongs, Take small sections, get the strand of hair, wrap it around the curling tongue, and then hold for about seven seconds. Then let go, and as you can see, we've got a nice tight curl. Carry on doing this throughout this section, alternating the way that you do the curls. So we'll do one curl that way, one curl this way. Hold for seven seconds. Let go. Right, okay, so once you've almost just curled this section, I'm holding for seven seconds. Let go. Then what I need you to do is get your fingers and literally just pull through. Not too much, because we don't want to go too much frizz, but we need a little bit of frizz there, because with Nicole's, it's not completely smooth. It has got a little bit of frizz. So pull through slightly. Get your comb and literally just back comb at the roots there, just to create a little bit of body and a little bit of volume. Once you've done the back combing, use your hairspray just to spray on the roots, just to hold the back comb that you just put in, and then lightly just spray through the ends. Then once you've done that, take another section, and we're going to do the same procedure that we just did at the bottom using the curling tongues. Right, okay, so I'm now just doing the last curl on this middle section, holding for seven seconds, then let go, you've got your curl there, pull it through with your fingers, not too much because we don't want to get causing the freeze, creating the freeze, then we need to get the comb just to lightly back comb at the roots, now don't forget this is important to put your back combing in because this is what's going to make the stole last, back combing at the roots. This is looking shamazing. Lovely hairspray. Now what I need you to do is carry on these sections, next section, next section, but leave a panel out on top, and we'll come to that in a second, and I'll show you how to finish the look off. So I'll see you in a second. So we've put the curls in there with the curling tongue. Now it's time to work on the top. With Nicole, she has got a centre part in, um, but what I'm gonna do first is literally just take a section of hair back. I'm just gonna pop this down at the front. This back section, we need to back comb at the root, just get enough lift in there. Then take another section, because this bit's coming back as well. Then back comb at the root with that as well. Smoothing over like that. Then with the centre parting, take it down the centre. Take that over to that way. Then what we need to do is literally back comb this section Push it over, back home this section. So we've got both of those sections back home now. Then what we need to do is curl just the mid length and ends. Once we've done that, I'll come back to you and I'll show you how to smooth. Now we've got all the curls in there, we've put the back home in there. It's just now time to smooth the top bit from the centre parting. So literally, get a smooth bristle brush, or you can do it with a comb as well, just to smooth out the roots, leave it, and just sort of mess with your fingers, just to make it a little bit more bigger. Get the hairspray, just to set it. Do the same on the other side as well. Thank you. 
There you go. This looks absolutely shamazing. Or as Nicole says in the yoghurt advert, it is mullalicious. See you soon. Thanks for watching. Take care.